Hello everyone, my name is Zed, and today let's talk about how to integrate with Frame.io. Before we get started, let's go through a quick little scenario. Imagine you just got yourself a set of dailies and you want to upload them into Frame.io. Well first you have to download them, then wait, then upload them to Frame.io, then wait while the upload takes place. That's a lot of waiting. So we work together with Frame.io to create a new integration where anything uploaded to a specific portal will go straight into Frame.io with no user intervention. That means once you have your dailies, they're already in Frame.io ready for you to log in and get started right away. Let's go through how to set one up. To begin, you will need a developer token for your Frame.io account. The developer token is what Massive will use to interface with your account. To get there, you will need to go to developer.frame.io. The link will also be in the video description down below. From here, make sure you are logged in with your Frame.io account and select Tokens on the left side menu. Next, press the New button. Make sure to give your token a name before proceeding. From here, you will need to select Read for Accounts, Read for Teams, Read for Projects, and finally Delete, Create, Update, and Read for Assets. After you have selected these, scroll down to the bottom of the page and press Create. Make sure to copy your token as it will only be shown once. Now that you have your developer token, let's head on over to your massive account. Let's open up the left side menu and navigate to Cloud Connect. You're going to want to hit the Frame.io button. If you already have other cloud connections, hit New Connection in the top right and select Frame.io from the drop down. First, give your connection a name. Next, paste that developer token and hit the verify button. After it loads, go to the drop downs and make sure you select the correct team and project you would like the assets to go into. After this is complete, press the connect button. Next, from the left side menu, let's navigate to the portal section and press the new portal button. First, you give your portal a name and subdomain. After entering this information, press the continue button. The next two steps are any optional settings you would like to set up for your portal. Step 4 is where the magic happens. On step 4, you'll see your Deliver to Cloud options. Hit Select Connections and select Frame.io from the list. Once you've selected Frame.io, feel free to close the pop-up menu. Next, let's hit the Create button. You now have a portal created where anything uploaded to that portal will automatically get uploaded directly to your Frame.io account in the project that you selected earlier. If you have an existing portal that you would like to add the Frame.io connection to, simply hit the edit button on the portal, hit select connections, and click Frame.io and close the menu. From there, hit update portal, and that portal will also now send all its uploads directly to Frame.io. Let's take a look at a quick example. Let's upload a package to our massive media portal which is connected to Frame.io and give the package the name Screen Recordings for YouTube. Let's now take a look at what the package looks like when it is uploaded to Frame.io. In the project we connected earlier we can see a folder called Portal Downloads. This folder will be where all massive portals deliver their packages to. When we open that folder you can see the different portals that have received packages. When we open a portal, in this case Massive Media Project, we can see the package screen recordings for YouTube that we sent earlier. There you go, you are now connected with Frame.io. If you'd like to try either Frame.io or Massive, their individual sign-up links will be in the video description below, as well as a help article that goes through everything we talked about today that you can refer back to later. If you have any questions about what we talked about today, feel free to email us at team at massive.io or reach out to us on Twitter at MassiveFast. Make sure to like and subscribe down below, stay safe, and happy creating!